So Sonic kind of just beats Fox at his own game. You good, Jack? Yeah. Had to grab the Gatorade. Water now. Huh? It's just water. It's safe. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. He's, uh, going Karma. Okay. I'll say if it's the capital letter, it's going to be Fox. Because it's uh, Smash Tap. Mm -hmm. All right. I was, uh, I thought it was just two completely different tags, Karma hey, and Cobalt, you're using Seth's tag. Hey, we got a, we got a, a little bit of delay here. All right, a short game one. <laughs> All right, no contest. One, one now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, no, nah, I'm, uh... I was coaching up, Cobalt. It's in I'm thinking about uh, bringing it up at Sonora's campaign. You should. I will help you. Ball? Ball? Uh, I'm also as a ball. I'm also as a ball from uh, Jason. Nice. So uh, me and Gabriel can talk a lot. This is uh, helping me out with the games. Yeah. Uh, nonetheless, let's get to it. Winner's finals. We've got Cobalt versus Joe Sai. Now using the correct tags. There we go. Immediately in the spin deck. Yeah. And that's one of the things I think. If this game goes Ari, Joseph definitely got to pick up Flapper, right? Um, I, I, I think Rob Nair beats out Spin Dash 2, though, right? And Rob's heavy enough yeah. to stay alive longer against Sonic. But Joseph's also been playing Cloud and Fox, so it turns out hasn't played Rob once. True. I just saw him playing Rob and Friendly, so that's what made me think about it. Yeah. He may have been practicing the Rob Friendly match. I, I could I would expect that from As I said in the last set, these guys, greatness, uh, greatness on a different level. I think this is the uh, big matchup for number one PR this semester. I would agree, especially Even with Skylo think, not competing as much. Yeah, truly, anybody can get it because that's just how Smash works. I don't know about anybody. Anybody. <laughs> Anybody can get it. That's just how Smash works. Anybody can win any. Interesting up smash from Cobalt when yeah. Josai was nowhere near him. I guess I see it. It's interesting. It's a, it's Ooh, a pretty quick safe back air to take the first stock. Yeah, great back air. That's the thing. Up smash with Sonic is a pretty safe option. I mean, yeah, his whole body's a hitbox. Of course yeah. it's safe. But another back air to not quite take the stock. But we got a good ledge trap situation this going thing, on. Uh, just has got a lot of kills in this. Uh, I kills a lot of stocks in this tournament. With, especially up against uh, not Chatty's game of ledge. Mm. You can see on the board, we have the same combo as the spin deck. One to up and down. Such a good combo. Good patience from both players Ooh, in that direction. Go that time, and that's Ooh. definitely going to take this. I was not aware that Sonic's Nair was a kill move. Yes. Especially out of spin dash, it's so good. And Cobalt is just such a great effect. Dodging the homing attack into up smash, that was very yeah. nice on Josai's part. That's uh, one of the things I talked to uh, Cobalt about is that you watch the up smash. It's playing cloud, you gotta watch the up smash. Mm -hmm. We'll go straight up forward there. And a full stop. Yeah, a full stop. So I would say this is looking pretty good for Cobalt right now. Yeah. A little grin here for uh, Josai. Naren to jab will put on some good percent really quick. Really keeping uh, Cobalt at this ledge. Trying to pin him down into this advantage state, but Sonic has some really good tools to get out of disadvantage. Oh, side B to up air will take the stock. Only 90% down, this is now looking very doable for Josai. Oh. Almost off for a second there, but we know who this is. That's fair. Fox alive at 150. This is really impressive. Fox. Here, like character. Yeah, it's Josai. DI and Peck. But just has to play very carefully here for the rest of this yeah. game. One back air. He was looking for it there. Very much 
Good lord, this ledge trap has been going on for 10 seconds. Nair to interrupt the spin dash. This has me literally biting my nails right now. Liar, you're not biting your nails. Oh, crazy. <laughs> Cobalt is very bold with these down airs. Really trying to get that will probably be it. Wow. An incredible game one on both players' parts. With Cobalt going up 1-0. Oh. Wow. What <laughs> game? Can you pass me my drink, please? Thank you. These things are so good. Yeah. All right, going into game two. No character changes. Still on PS2. No I did put up a really good fight against the Sonic last game. And now there's the up tilts. Oh, the stage spike. Up No tech, but the percent was low enough that it didn't really matter. Oh, that. Interesting. Very bold. I think, I'm not sure why they're coming out though with uh, Josai's mostly horizontal recovery. Yeah. Forwarded up smash not quite killing. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if we see a low Josai recovery, we're, we know for sure Cobalt will cover it. I just, I don't know, I feel like there are more effective ways that uh, Cobalt could cover the ledge right now. But it's not like it isn't working. So True. It's a good amount of extra credit. Already at 30%. Take it 36. Excellent. Just in general defensive play and shield discipline from Cobalt. Just waiting out all of Josai's options. And the up smash will take the first stop. 85% behind. This is still very much anyone's game. <laughs> Grab a jab, bring him up to 40%. But. Yeah. Actually makes Sonic Going for the double back air, not connecting with either of them. That back air will take the stock. Only 35%. From how big of a deficit he was at earlier, this is really impressive. Just like just having the patience to wait out all of Cobalt's spin dashes and spin charges. I still can't tell the difference. <laughs> <laughs> See? Oh. But an excellent strength from Josai bringing this game back to completely even. And now he's in the lead. Um, what a couple. Who's winning? Couple. Oh, okay. 
But the up smash will take the game up smash out of shield with the train. Town and Kalos are the bands. Let's see where we go for game three. Going right to Smashville. Who is Ricky? Anyway, game three, going to Smashville. No character changes yet. Now I understand it though, with the win from game two. Joseph with a slight lead, just both characters trying to find their openings. Attacking on damage little by little. I think Jose has really started to get a hold on uh, Cobalt's movement this set. Oh, up smash at the ledge. We'll take the first stock, anticipating that normal get up. Coming into the second stock, we're trying to see how much extra credit Jose can tack on. This is the first game where Josiah has had a solid lead from the start. This could be a sign of the set turning around. An excellent little string from Josiah bringing Cobalt all the way up to 50%. Using the shine stall to uh, mix up the timing so that he could not get punished. A good read from Josiah with the back air, putting Cobalt off stage yet again. Ooh, Cobalt trying to back air the ledge, but the timing's not quite there. Josai just dancing around all of these smash decks Cobalt is throwing out. And an up smash will take the second stock too. Josai is still on the first stock. But the F smash will take it, but a full stock lead for Josai in this game three. We have the national anthem going on in the background. Hey, Josai is seeming firmly in control of this game. Cobalt bringing it back to last stock, but 100% down. Can he bring this game three back? Oh, uh, sure. Yeah. I was just checking. Game uh, one one. Oh, two one. Make that two one. Yeah. Josai taking game three. They're both just absurd. It's such a beautiful video. Mm -hmm. Now this game has really shown a turnaround for the set. But in both game one and game two, it was really close. But with Khalil taking an early lead in each game, this time Josai was in control from the very start. Wow. He can look so dominant when, it's, when his game plan's running the way he wants it to. And also, he's just fast. So we'll see if that continues into game four here. I did not catch the stage pick, so we'll have to see once they start. It's always fun to be surprised. That's what I'm here for. How's your bracket path going tonight? It was good. I went 2-2. Um, nice. Yeah, lost to Chatty and... 
uh, Revival, which are both people I've lost to before, so not a huge surprise. But I feel like I played pretty well in the And who'd you beat? Um, 9k and... Let me check. Okay. Oh! No, almost no. Cobalt's recovery is ridiculous. But an unfortunate, very close to an SD to start us off. This game is seem to be starting out more even again with Cobalt taking a slight lead. I think the stage pick was really what had changed in the game three. Mm -hmm. Who did, where, where did they go? Uh, Smashville for game three. Huh. And Josai was dominant on Smashville. But now that it's PS2, it's looking even to Cobalt favored yeah, right now. A little now. more room for Sonic. The middle platform is also such a different thing to have to interact with. Mm -hmm. I like middle platforms. That's why I like Hollow Bastion so much. Yeah. I need to get into using it more because I know with uh, Ivy Sword specifically, you get some brutal tech chases. Yeah. You're not? Okay. Good Everyone give a huge shout out to yeah, JCK so for commentating all night. Oh, 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 that no, no, is no, on. Oh. Yeah, no, no. it's Sonic. That. Yeah, he bumped his head and it's still safe. That's, that's unreasonable. <laughs> it is a little. So, uh, Cobalt trying to attack on a bit of extra yeah, credit. Oh, but, oh DIing the up smash excellently to keep this first stock going. So clutch. Searching for the back air at ledge and not finding it. Those short hop backers from Fox are so intimidating. But Nair to nice. Oh, dodge. intimidating with the air dodge. You really expect to see that top smash right after that Nair, so mm -hmm. good luck from Cobalt here, honestly. And I think, I mean, Josai just I was honestly going to say good from Josai, intimidating him off stage. That's pretty true, actually. And when you pull that air dodge resource away from Sonic during his recovery, it, it really cuts out his options, because normally that's a huge Ooh, Oh, narrowly there missing the up smash. I don't want up smash two. return. <laughs> Dash attack to interrupt the spin charge. That was right. interesting. Yeah, you don't see that every day. <laughs> also, I always forget when I play Sonics that I can just grab him straight out of the spin charge. Mm -hmm. it's such a, like, we With so used to be afraid of the move. Normal grab or side B. Both of them will just snatch him right out of spin charge. I also feel like having the threat of, of revenge pretty nice for us in a row now. Mm -hmm. It's still on one of the worst matchups in the game. Oh, yeah. Oh, undoubtedly. Because once you start playing, keep away. I mean... Mm. And even with a lead, I feel like you'd be calm, calm with you. Yeah, arguably the worst matchup in the game. Really? Is Incinero Sonic. Yeah, that back row. Clean up. Yep, only 40% on Cobalt with a full stock lead. Let us see what Josai can do with this. It's where you'd love to be a Sonic, but I know I saw it in game one, Josai nearly making a few stock. A so raw F smash it. just connecting there to put Cobalt off stage. Just clean up totally. Oh, going for the up smash there. Down air. Not leading it to anything here. It's interesting to see Sonic being the one who's getting danced around. It's so true. It's a little bit uh, like Dragon Ball or like uh, Naruto Core with the they're going to my eyes. <laughs> Josa just standing He's there. Rock. He's, thinking for a sec. He's just standing there waiting while Cobalt does his thing. Mm -hmm. You can charge your spin charge. I'll wait over here. I'm surprised he didn't shoot the gun a little bit. I guess it's kind of hard to react. To. Like you can get stuck yeah, in, in can. lag from me for me. Oh, Sonic just outrunning the up smash. Yeah, <laughs> Have you seen the video? Sonic can just run over and send uh, Isabelle's little rocket. <laughs> He can just so run fun. past it. My whole <laughs> okay, well that was an unfortunate SD from Cobalt missing the ledge with an air dodge. But it's a good position for Joe's side. This is definitely doable. Not like if you get hit by those spin meshes though. Ooh. And that so F smash. Oh, what's the move here? No springs. Forward air off of ledge. Oh. oh. Another forwarder off a of ledge. These forwarders are doing a lot of work right now. Yeah, a little, uh, wi -Fi cool. Dash attack Nair, dash attack? What was that? <laughs> Did He's you Lincoln. see that? Yeah. <laughs> That's Fox stuff. Oh. Rolling out of the side V. And Fox does have links on that move, so it's nice to be able to say. Shielding it, always. Oh, oh, oh. my god. No! Smash attack fight. There it is. Going to game five. He got the jab reset and everything. I was sure that was the game. Bringing this to game five. It is 2-2 in this 
Winners finals. That's what you want to see. And man, Cobalt has just been playing his ass off, or been playing really well in set after set. It takes a lot of stamina to go before game fives, especially in, in winners and on stream, right? You got people watching. You're playing an incredibly technical character at a very high level. It's hard. Both characters seem to be sweating a little bit. Both yeah. players, I mean. You know what's funny? I think it's interesting what we have in winners' finals versus losers' finals right now. We have two very different like winners, speed, two speedsters. Losers, we have a game and launch and a snake. Mm. It's going to lead to some interesting matchups going forward. I feel like. Yeah. I know. Uh, Khalil. Or so not losers' finals. Losers' semis. Mm -hmm. I know Khalil's performing very well over Goon in friendlies. Oh yeah. I don't know if they faced in bracket yet, but. The Sonic Snake does seem to be very much in Cobalt's face. That makes a lot of sense to me. I feel like a lot of Snake stuff is reliant on people not pushing it. Sonic, you, you have, no one ever knows when you're going to do it. When you're going to do it, you get a huge advantage. Yes. But I'm going to yeah, go ahead. small battlefield for game five. And Close very little different. happening so far. Just <laughs> pretty much even. Nice. Dodging the homing attack and getting a little dash tech out of it. Wow, Nair nice F smash to add on a a lot of percent. <laughs> Up tilting out of the spin, the start off with the spin <laughs> charge. Yeah, it works, it works. I need to see, we need to see some combos on the football. He's normally so quick to get his opponent up to like, you know, 50 or 60 and he got to return the favor. Oh, that's good. He it again. I feel like that's like the same percent it was on, on PS2. Pulling it out at over 100% after the hit. Amazing. The shield discipline from Josai is it's like it's so important in this matchup. It looks like oh yeah you just hold shield against but like it takes a lot of confidence into um, it's a difficult to do. Mm -hmm. I think a shield just not necessarily even in this matchup, but shields in general it's are so a very underappreciated part of Smash. Mm -hmm. People don't really realize how technical using your shield properly actually is. Yeah, the, the range where you can't use it. You can see Josai dashing back and forth there. During those initial dash frames, there's no shield, so it puts him at a risk of an approach from Cobalt. That's why things like extended dash cancel are so good. Yes. They let you get the speed of your uh, initial dash and then immediately cancel that into a walk where you can act out of anything. And then, and even, I mean, you mentioned it there, but even walking, right? Like, walking is a thing. No, hardly anyone, everyone's always dashing around this mm -hmm. game, but a walk leaves you open nice. That's the link we need to see from Cobalt. Off stage, where's the edge guard? Got a spring? Back air? Ooh. Mm, decent idea with the two-frame attempt, but just not quite fast enough. Josai waiting patiently to see what uh, Cobalt will do out of the spin charge. And just jump over it. Apparently yeah, that's the literally move. that's the move. <laughs> nice, the back air. Now there's one more chance here for Josai. Down air. I, why? Cobalt has been going for these down airs a lot no this spring? set, and none spring. of them have connected. I wouldn't say any of them have really even been close. I'm really yeah. not sure why he's doing it. You know, Cobalt is on a mission to make Sonic cool. He loves <laughs> the character, like, outside of the context. Oh, again, cool. another. There's that Nair into the Intimidation Air Dodge. And waiting on the read for internal. You see that in Smash? That was mm -hmm. sick. Would have been the backer after. taking that first stock, but 140% on Joe's side. Yeah, and with Fox Lightness. And yep. <laughs> that'll ba back air trade. There we go. Even game five, second stock. What's the move here? You really ex with, with how because Fox is fast, sure. But mm -hmm. you expect to see his offstage like maneuvers to get back in. You just expect to see him get edge guarded. Um, yeah. That's something Sonic is really solid at. So I'm, I'm wondering what Cobalt's answer will be here. The answer seems to be covering landings more than anything offstage. Right. And which is which is to be fair, working. Already seven percent, seventy percent on the second side. Great patience from Josai there. Yeah, what's the let's trap? Yeah, I'm reading the neutral window. Yeah. Nice link. Yep. That's that beefy Fox combo for Savior. Yeah. Fox's up air is such a weird move. Right? Ooh, yeah. Like when you look at it, it looks like a brain dead juggle tool, but then when you actually try to use it. It's such a short frame window to link them together. Like you have, and, you have, and I mean, like. Oh, the forward air will take the second clean, stop. 72% on Cobalt. This is still very doable for both players. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no one's out. But every, I mean, every percent the Cobalt gets here is wonderful extra credit. Nice. Just barely outside that Fox Illusion break. Oh, missing that backer. I think he fast fell too hard and 
the hit the, the early auto cancel window of back air, so the hitbox never came out. Mm -hmm. It's a, and with how with how fast Fox falls, it's a small window to get those back airs out, especially at the optimal height. Mix up on shield, mix up on mix up. A full stock behind. This is a tough spot for yeah, Joe. Yeah, literally. But Foxes, mm. I mean, one nice neutral And there we go, Nair to up smash. Interesting, ended up at 118 again, died this time. So no, yeah, the other not. ones were 116 and 117. There you go, thanks for remembering. It was 1% higher. That's the 1% one one higher, yeah. <laughs> and 80% behind on this course. last set, this last stock here. And the shield is a skittle. What's the pun? This is the winner side stock for both players. Yeah. Who will be waiting winner side of grants? It all gets determined here. Ooh, so incredible oh. shield. Look at him space outside oh. of those side beats from Fox. Just brilliant. How does it finish? Dash attack, not Stage, good. That's it. And forward air will take yeah. the set. Great Excellent win from Cobalt. Cobalt, who will be going on to Grand Finals. Grand Finals winner side. Now we will be seeing not Chatty and Goon, mm -hmm. and the winner of that will play Josa. That's true. We got our winners final or our grand finals decided. Got our losers finals. Now all that's left is losers semis. Nah. Mm -hmm. Did you like to sit over here? No, it's fine. All right. Up next, we have the losers. Quarterfinals. Not Chatty versus Goon. So what did you think of all those down airs Khalil was throwing? I don't know. I thought they were interesting. We're gonna get started, just join when you can. Fuck you and goodbye. Yeah, I don't mind. Um my best friends pulled a prank on me. Um 